Man, nothing like the smell of fried worms to really lift your spirits. Yes, just like Mother's cooking. Here we go. Which way? One of these has got to lead us back to Hala. Whoa, 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 hold up. You actually want to keep going after Hala? Maybe you were watching a different show, but in the one I saw, the forge blew up in her face and she wound up with godlike powers. So, you're okay with being responsible for Hala laying waste to the entire galaxy? Wasn't my idea to try and destroy it. I said it would be bad news, basically told you exactly what would happen. Boom! Forge in the face, Mega Hala. Magala. You are terrible at naming things. What we really should call her is a big friggin' problem for us. Cause that's what she is. Maybe charging it would have been better. Adoy. No, Peter. No one should be able to wield that kind of power. Uh, I got bad news for you then. She's got it. She's got that power in her face! Which is exactly why we have to go after her. You don't get to talk, Gamora. Cause of you, now we gotta deal with your psycho cyborg sister too. You're the reason she's all nuts, so. Shut your filthy rodent mouth. I know I failed her. I don't need you to twist the knife. I'm just pointing out the obvious here, because you're all too friggin' blind to say it. We go after Hala, we go after Nebula, one of us gets killed. End of story. I know her better than any of you. There could still be good in her. There's still a chance I could save her. Eh, some people ain't worth saving. And Nebula falls squarely into that special category of trash. Look, shut up, both of you. We gotta get out of here, and neither of you are helping. No, you shut up, Quill. Tired of hearing the sound your, your face is making. Blah, 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 Eternity Forge. Blah, 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 family. Blah, 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 mom. Where? Shut up! Yeah, shut up. He lit this fire just to watch us all burn. That's what he wants. No, what I want is to not see your face anymore! Fine by me. Hey. All this, it's your fault, Quill. If you hadn't exploded the forge, I'd have one less thing to be pissed at you for. Let's go, Groot. I am Groot. What? Oh, fine, you big baby. I didn't need any of you when I started in this business, and I don't need you now. Better off on my own. Rocket, wait up! Go with the rodent. I will protect Gamora. Do not worry. Sometimes I do not need to tell you how the others are feeling. Makes my job easy. Check this place out. What do you think made these tunnels? Who knows and who frickin' cares? I don't get it. Why isn't Groot with me? He always comes with me. But if he don't need me, I don't need him. Or anyone else for that matter. Besides, it'll be invigorating to be on my own. No one telling me what to do, asking me to translate that overgrown stick every damn minute. Oh, you Groot! Pfft. I am free! Look, we need you, Rocket. And I know you don't want to admit it, but you need us. Hey, it was a good run, Pete. But I'd rather get out while I'm ahead. So there's no need for you to follow me. You could have just joined the others and gone on your merry little way. Emo assassin. Big literal guy. Three word tree and you, helpless human. That sounds like quite the dream team. You don't need a rocket raccoon, or whatever kind of animal you think I am. Come on, you know you're my friend. The turner to my hooch. Hey, I'm nobody's hooch. No, 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 no. <laughs> you're Turner. <laughs> He's this dog. Oh, who... so I'm just some pet to you? Maybe. 
Maybe I can, uh... <sighs> hey, would... would you just... Oh, I thought you didn't need any help. This is different, and you know it. Huzzah! What a victory! Move from one tomb to another. I'm sure there's a way out. It wasn't always like this. You know, Pete, back in the good old days, I'd never be caught dead in some festering wormhole. It was just me and Groot doing whatever the hell we wanted. Being a guardian has put a real cramp in our style. All we do is clean up other people's messes. Janitors of the galaxy. That's what we should be called. And Hala and the Kree? Well, they're just the latest cosmic spill. What? No, we totally have fun. Remember when we kicked the crap out of Thanos' lifeless corpse? <laughs> yeah, I do love kicking corpses. But it doesn't make things any better in the present. Things don't feel right no more. Maybe the bug lady got to me. Maybe it's the ever-growing enemies list. I don't know, man. Maybe we should just... Well, there was a passage out of here. Maybe there's a way to open it up again. Yeah, you find that. I'll, uh, supervise. There's a breeze coming from the other side. Yeah. I smell somewhat fresh air. But how are we gonna bust through? Might as well give this a shot. <laughs> shot. Uh... All right, all right, enough already. It's not working. Hey, Rocket, up there. More of those explosive crystal-y things. It's good for blasting open cave-ins, right? Nothing like a good old-fashioned explosion to solve your problems. Just need to find a way to get our hands on them. Hey, check it out. Yeah, stick your head in one of them and see what happens. I'll be standing by with some of my trademark wit. Um, pass? Okay, we've got exploding rocks and a network of little tunnels. I just need to figure out which tunnels go... Another one of those worm tunnels. Yep, it's a hole. This tunnel's a dead end. Let's see where you go. Hey, Rocket. What's up, Pete? I wonder what the others are up to. You think they're okay? Nah, I'm not too worried. Groot is pretty resilient. Takes more than a few slippery worms to face him. What about Gamora? Ugh, the psycho assassin. What about her? Nah, I'm just worried, that's all. Yeah, well, then we should hurry out of here. Great news, Rocket. I figured out a way to get to the Torium. All by yourself, huh? Adorable. See, what we gotta do is crawl into those tunnels, and we can reach the crystals. 
<laughs> oh, sweet, stupid Pete. Your fat head won't fit in one of those. I mean... Come on, really? I checked with my scanner. This hole leads right to the Torium. I feel attacked. Fine. Making me crawl around on all fours. How humiliating. If I die, bury me with my gun. In fact, bury me with all of them. You'll need a pretty sizable casket, but hey, I'm worth it. Especially after this ridiculous favor I'm doing you. All the worms are probably long gone by now. Remember how many we killed? Yeah, I do. With great joy. But the thing with little creatures like that, there's always more. Well, if I'm going in here, you gotta help too. I need you to find me a sulfuric isotopic membrane. Uh, what now? It's a film that forms on the bottom of those sulfur pools that'll stabilize the Torium crystals. What the hell is this stuff? Oh, oh God, I'm gonna... Oh. Oh, come on! There's nothing in here! A what? Oh, oh, I just made that up, because you made me crawl into those wormholes. Oh, okay. Okay. Maybe I deserve that. <sighs> I can't get something out of my brain. When I had to watch you die, it really messed me up, man. I just don't want to see my friends get hurt. After Lila... I, I can't go through that again. We can't do this without you. You're a crucial member of this team. Hate to say it, pal, but you can't do this with me. Hala's got everything she needs. She's practically invincible now. I know, I know. But for the first time in a long time, I found people who care about me. Who I care about. And that's terrifying. <sighs> I... I'm gonna take a shot at getting some of this Torium out. You do what you gotta do. Rocket, you okay up there? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Here, catch this thing. Oh, jeez, that was close. Great, you're not dead. Listen, Pete. I know you think you can't do this without me, but I can't help you no more. I can't save everyone. I mean it this time, man. When we get out of here, I'm out. I need you to respect that. Please. You shouldn't be alone right now. We can help you through this. You can't force me to stay. I ain't trading one cage for another. Between being alone and being dead, I choose alone. Here, let's just blow this up and be done with it. All right, I get it. Let's just do this, okay? Better back up. Time, Time to, to make, make some donuts. pebbles out of these big boys. What the hell are you doing? Uh... Hey, I came up with the plan. I get to blast the stones. Not to mention crawling into those disgusting holes. If anyone gets to do it, it's me. Rocket. Actually... You can do it. Aw, oh, Quill. You're a real softy sometimes. You know how much I love detonating things. Anytime, buddy. Enjoy. <laughs> it's time for my sweet revenge. On the wall? On the wall! Yeah, it could have exploded more. Whatever, man. That was cool. Wow, you really stink. I mean, that is just foul. 
like month-old rotten fish left out in the sun. Why do you do this? Because it's hilarious! <laughs> oh, come on, you used to respect a good gag. Ugh, how long are these freaking tunnels? We get it, we're in a cave. Excellent smell receptors. It was just a little scare for Okay, no big deal. Get over it. Can we just keep moving, please? The end of the tunnel's just up ahead. Gamora! Hey! Hey! Gamora! Wake up! Ah, uh, more like Universal Church of Jerks. Okay, okay. We're gonna get you out of here. Nothing would have if you had come with us. 